Happy New Year, Aquarius! January is certainly going to be an eventful month for you, and happily, the end of the month is fantastic. But first, let's get rid of the first half of the month. On the 12th, there will be a full moon in your sixth house of work. Now, this can be a coworker or colleague leaving the office, but if this does happen, there's going to be some kind of drama around it, and you're wrapped up in the emotionality of it all. If you own a business, you might have to fire someone during this time, and that's never an easy thing to do, and there's going to be some emotional fallout with this situation. So just do your best to remain professional and handle it. Now, it's also possible that you're the one who's leaving a job. You're the one who's finishing an assignment, but this is not going the way you want. It's not a happy ending, okay? But that will end soon enough, and January 27th is an entire new beginning for you. It is really exciting because a new moon will fall in your sign, and this new moon is so good, so happy. And I know that you're ready for a very fabulous personal fresh start in relationship, in personal goals, in personal identity. What you wanna put out there in the world, it's all going to happen. Make sure you put something good out there within two weeks of this new moon. Then on the 28th, Mars will move into your third house of communication. Mars remains there until March 9th. With Mars in this part of your chart, you've got the courage to speak up for yourself. You've got the courage to communicate messages with great authority and just courage. It's amazing. People are listening to you because your words command respect. And yes, you could come across as a little intimidating, so be aware of that. And you might be so enthusiastic about your ideas, so be aware of that as well. But that's really not such a bad thing, is it? Now that you know what's in store for you this January, be sure to watch more astrology videos with me right here at tarot.com.